After the 4.4 magnitude earthquake recorded on the evening of May 20, 2024 in the Campi Flegre area, near Naples, we are again talking about this area with very strange geological characteristics. Many are wondering whether there is something to fear about an imminent catastrophic shock or whether the fears are exaggerated. The seismic activity recorded in the last few hours in the Campi Flegre area has revived the hypothesis of an eruption of this ancient supervolcano located in the Gulf of Pozzuoli. But what do the experts think? One of the latest studies carried out in the Campania Volcanic Area by University College London and the National Institute of Geophysics and Volcanology INGV, used a model of rock fracture physics to interpret recent earthquakes and uplifts in the Flegrain fields. The conclusion is that part of the rocks in Campi Flegre have been deformed to the point of breaking. The scientist's thesis, presented in Communications Earth and Environment, is that the accumulation of deformations in some parts of the volcano has made the rocks more brittle, less elastic, and more prone to rupture. This situation could lead to the formation of cracks that reach the surface from the interior of the caldera, creating conditions more favorable for an eruption. This is the first time that such a model has been applied to a volcano in real time. The area called Campi Flegre is a basin about 12 kilometers in diameter filled with volcanic craters that stretches from the hill of Pasilipo to Monte di Procida, with a submerged edge in the Gulf of Pozzuoli. This is the so-called caldera, a depression formed by two major collapses of the magma reservoir that occurred 39,000 and 15,000 years ago, in two of the most impressive volcanic eruptions. Although there is currently no eruptive activity, Campi Flegre continues to register a continuous background volcanic activity with frequent small earthquakes caused by ground deformation. The area is also closely monitored because it is home to 360,000 people. The first time we used this model was in 2017 and since then Campi Flegre has behaved as expected, with an increasing number of small earthquakes indicating underlying stress, explains Christopher Kilburn, first author. Our new study confirms that Campi Flegre is close to rupture. However, this does not mean that an eruption is certain. The fractures can open cracks in the Earth's crust, but for an eruption to occur, the magma needs to push into the right place. Now, the scientists explain, all that is needed is to estimate the probability that the magma or gas will find a new path to rise to the surface. In the last 10 years, the ground level of the volcano near Pozzuoli has risen by about 10 centimeters per year. And for the first time since the mid-1980s there have been continuous micro-earthquakes. According to the experts, the origin is the movement of liquid magma but also volcanic gases about 3 kilometers underground, which infiltrate the cracks in the rock and fill the Earth's crust like a sponge, thus damaging it. The frequency and type of earthquakes indicate that the rocks are reacting inelastically, that is, they are breaking, not bending. For the researchers, the maximum pressure that the rocks of Campi Flegre can withstand before breaking is currently about a third compared to 1984. According to the scientists, a possible eruption could be preceded by signs of greater calm, such as a lower intensity of earthquakes and a lower uplift of the Earth's crust. The same thing happened in 1994 on the Rabao volcano in New Guinea, 
which has a very similar shape to Campi Flegre. But the feared eruption may not happen, as Stefano Carlino of the Vesuvian Observatory, INGV, explains. Campi Flegre could go through a new routine of gradual uplift and subsidence, like other similar volcanoes in the world, or return to a state of calm. We cannot yet say for sure what will happen. The important thing is to be prepared for all eventualities.